All right, uh, welcome back everybody to another episode of Hide and Hold Out H2O Closed Beta. Um, now, in our previous uh, video, we uh, finished up making our base here, and we also made a jet ski and some ammo, so uh, we're good to go. Now, we need to put a little bit of fuel in this fella. All right, so now we got full, and we're going to head out. And I'd like to make a second, maybe even a third floor, um, on this base, and, um, so hopefully we won't crash into this sort of thing. Okay, so that worked out okay. Um, and the reason I want to make a second and third floor is because it kind of screwed up where I placed it. And I'll show you here in a second what I did. Um, so, uh, if you can see, this bridge... It goes right over um, to the point where somebody could jump off and get on the roof. And then all they need to do is knock out one roof uh, tile and they're in. So we're going to make it a little harder for them to do that. All right, so we're heading out. Oh, and uh, something I should do right now before I do anything else. Yeah, um, okay. Let's load this darn thing. All right, and we'll bring up that, and okay, good to go. All right. So, uh, order of business is more scrap, and we're going to be able to start picking stuff up really quick now. Uh, not close enough. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay. <laughs> No, you, yeah, you can land these things. <laughs> I wonder if he'll change that. I don't know. Um, probably a good idea if he did. Um, but then again, I, I mean, I I have had jet skis in my day, and you can get them up on shore. You just have to make sure it's not too too shallow for the back part, of the road. or you can do some damage. see it now. We'll have to drive to it, I guess. I was going to swim right to it. Where the heck did it? There it is. Okay. Probably didn't look in the right direction. And there is a garbage spawn over there. So, we'll grab that. Right there. I, I was just about to say we might run across the metal, too. <laughs> Which we did, so we're good. Okay. Garbage. And we're going to get some fuel. What a difference uh, being on a uh, jet ski compared to a flat pipe. Is there 
anybody in here? There was. Just a split second ago. Okay, so I don't need to worry about my weapon right now. Alright, that's a good thing. I'll grab some fuel. Got it. Head back over to the jet ski. And away we go. Alright. We got a couple spawns here. I'm gonna look for the green boxes that I know of. See what's in this darn thing. See if there's anything good. Oh, another wetsuit. <laughs> oh, and some rope. Now I've never used rope for anything. Now I'm just wondering if that's maybe for the, uh, probably for the elevator. And you want to make that? I'm assuming. All right, so we'll start looking for the metal. Popping up anywhere along here. Come on. Oh, we don't see him coming in. We'll see them going back out. We'll think, oh, there we go. got the flippers. They don't do anything for you, really, um, so they're kind of pointless, but aesthetically, it looks good having the flippers with the, uh, with the scuba gear. Now, yeah, it's, oh, no, oh, there is, okay. Grab this. Should probably should really be building my base here. Um, I do know this area so well. But this area is so popular. Um, 
you're just inviting disaster from other players. Alright, so we'll head over here. Okay, more copper. And there's that one green box up top here. Now, I wonder if he's going to eventually add where you have to refuel this torch. Um, nothing spectacular, but 33 nails and 15 uh, cables, that's pretty darn good. Because it seems like this torch just goes on and on and on and on. I've never ran one out. So it makes me wonder if maybe he'll implement that sometime. It kind of makes sense. Um, either you, you know you eventually have to make one, a new one, or it runs out of fuel and you have to refuel it. <coughs> well, we'll see. I'm not complaining. It's nice not having to worry about refueling this darn thing. If you're going for realism, um, that would be a factor. Alright, more copper. I, I actually rather have the metal than the copper and the sand, but beggars can't be choosers. Alright. I don't know why, but I think they changed the jet ski because I don't remember. If you look at the front of the jet ski here, it seems to be like a light right there. That looks like a fuel tank or a nitrox tank, and that looks like a bedroll. And I don't remember those being there in, in the previous build, so I think that's something new. Makes it look different. Alright. Maybe that's, uh, oh, that's why. See, I wasn't seeing that. I kept coming back here, and I wasn't seeing metal. Usually there's metal there, but the reason that every time I come here, it's because that was that copper. Okay, that wasn't good. Um, so now um, I know to make double check that because the copper is hard to see on the water. That's Grab this one over here. Turn it a little bit. We got the garbage there. Now, there should be somewhere. It's hard to remember every one of them, but it seems to me there was something in this area. But I could be wrong. It could be the first time. Shadows. That, that, man, those drive me crazy because I think I'm seeing metal spawns. Oh, got somebody else in here. Alright. It's changed position. Okay. Okay, because I kept looking for that one. It is in a different spot now.
that was a different one. So I just found a new one, actually. But where is that one? It usually spawns right here. I wonder is that maybe... Oh, there's another... See, again, the copper. Gold sand. That's why I'm not seeing it. Okay. Well, probably next time that'll be metal. Yeah. have copper up the yin yang and not that it does much good. Uh, now I I would have thought for the bullet casings instead of the steel um, you would have ended up using the, uh, the copper. It's supposed to be brass but um, I would think instead of the steel you would end up using the, uh, the copper for the bullet casings. Alright. in here. Alright, why isn't this person showing up? Oh, that's strange. Oh, unless it's one of the, uh, maybe it's one of the, uh, one of the two devs. I wonder if it's in here. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, I guess what I just found. There's another reason why we're not seeing that spawn. Alright, where did that go? right here somewhere. Darn. They're so hard to see underwater. Where are you? Oh, it's here. I know darn well I saw gold sand. I'm up here. Is that it there? Oh, man. Darn it. That is so hard to spot. I just caught it out of the It is here. Oh, there it is. Oh, let me guess. I got turned around. Alright, well, we'll go under and make a little bit of a swim here. I, I know I saw it. It's just now finding it. There it is. Turn right. So now, see, these should turn into uh, a metal spawn. That's why I wasn't finding all the uh, metal spawns that I usually do. Kind of makes sense why that was happening. So the next time I come back over here, I'm pretty much guaranteed to find it out. Well, that or wood. And uh, I would imagine underwater it's either going to be copper or, uh, or the metal. That's, we'll take advantage of the nighttime to get building. Right. Now, if it was here, I would see it right about now. Uh, I don't think it's spawned back in yet. Nah. Nope, okay. Can't waste too much time looking for that one thing. Alright, so we'll pop this thing up and just make a quick run up for so we ran that. Oh my good lord, did I overshoot that?
Yeah, one. But I mean, it's worth it's worth topping it up, and grabbing the one. Definitely. Now I'm just in case because this this guy's bothering me. Um, why he isn't showing up in the list? Um, I'm gonna have this weapon handy just in case. So, um, we're almost at the end of this episode. Um, we're into that 20 minute mark again. So, what I'll do is, um, we'll end it here. And if anybody uh, wants to leave a like and dislike, a comment, I do check every comment. I don't always um, send a comment back out because of the problems I have with the nerve damage in my arms, my hands. I will try. And um, so what we'll do is, yeah, when we'll get back to base uh, and start the next episode, we'll start working on uh, the second floor. So I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. And, um, you know, please subscribe uh, if you feel uh, you can. And take care and bye-bye uh, now.